Hi guys, this is Glenn here, Metro Business in Box Hill. Well, it's been a while since I've posted a video. It's now the 30th of November and the last day of spring and I've got a great video for you. This one's on the new AK Interactive Air Series and the new series of AAV paints, which are really, really nice. Plus their primers. We're gonna give it uh, a bit of a go today, an airbrush. So without further ado, let's get going. The AAV series from AK Interactive's third generation, 1945 Panzer Colors, is an excellent addition. You can get a choice of doing other Panzer Force Panthers amongst other vehicles. They come in a sturdy box with a blister pack which holds the paint. And again, these are excellent to use. Here we have their 1937 to 1944 colors and of course their new Air Series. In this case, this is the US Navy and US Marine Corps aircraft colors with all the colors you need to complete these models. Again, six in their pack. This one, which is the Imperial Japanese Navy aircraft colors, has eight. And again, it does a variety of their aircraft. Along with the Royal Air Force colors, again, eight options or eight color options, and you get to do various aircraft. Excellent. In this review, we're going to use the 1945 Panzer Colors, which is the AFV series, and we'll start with using their Dunkelgelb, which is AK-11318. After a good shake, we're going to pour a little bit of that into our little palette. And you can see by looking at this, that it looks quite thick. Using their AK third generation thinner, AK-11500, we're going to add about 70-30, which means about 70% thinner and 30% paint. This is quite thick, so a good thinning down would help, certainly help it. We're going to use our trusty neopamine water, which is quite reliable. For example, today, we're going to use this lower hull of a T55, already primed with Timmy's excellent spray primer, fine, and we're going to give it a go. With the light strokes, let's make a move. And from what I can see, it goes on just beautiful. Little effort. And good coverage. That looks really good. Now that we've given the Dunkel Galb or the Dark Yellow ample time to dry, about two hours, and they do recommend 12 to 24 hours, but in this case, two hours with our time frame is fine. And it looks really, really good. Let's try using the red brown and their olive green. First being the red brown, which is AK-11328, followed by olive green, which is 11309. And again, we'll build up shades. It's going on really smooth. And as we build up the color tone, it looks really, really good. Lovely to spray, and that's a really nice red brown. That looks really good. Next, we'll use the olive green. And we can just see here that's going pretty much smoothly. You might want to add just a little bit more thinner. That's it. And that should give us a good consistency. Of course, being water based, it's a lot better for your lungs. Once again, just do a quick layer build up. And you can see it goes on beautifully. It dries really well. Just a light pressure. And 
and that's looking excellent. A nice green shade, and that is really convincing. We're going to use AK's primers. These are relatively new, and in this case, this one's double one, two, four, five. And this is Dunkel Gelb, so this is similar to what you saw before, but this is the primer version. And we're going to put it onto one of Tacom's T55 hulls, just by adding a little bit. Now it looks a little thick, but it looks really, really good. Again, it tells us to use the AK third generation thinner. And in this case, we're going to just add a few drops to that. See how we go with the consistency. Once again, this is Tacom's T55 as our experiment model. It's not primed and we're going to use this primer instead. And it goes on really smooth. Once again, we build up layers. And you can just see it going on slowly, but really effectively. This is really nice. And you can see it already beginning to form into its proper color. That looks really well, really controllable. It looks lovely and quite consistent all the way through. Well, that's it. An excellent product from AK Interactive. Their new air range and their Penza AV colors are great. Worth it. Guys, get online and get them now. They are excellent. Here's the proof. Until next time, stay safe and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.